If you are using iMovie and wondering how to make your audio to fade in and fade out smoothly like in this example, then after watching this video, you will be able to do that. In addition, if you are spending so much time for video editing, I will also introduce you a tool that saves a lot of time and effort, so make sure to watch this video till the end. Alright, so let's jump right into iMovie. Firstly, you need to open your project and drag your media files here. And also let's add the background music. So if the audio is longer than your clip, then you can reduce the length by either by dragging the end or the beginning of this audio file like this, or you can simply select the audio file and press on command B on your keyboard to cut the file so you can remove it later. So the audio can match the actual video clip, okay? So now let's continue with how to fade in and fade out the audio. Currently when we play the clip, the audio starts a bit late and when we end it, there is no fade and it doesn't sound professional. So first let's get rid of this part by dragging it to the beginning here. So the music can begin immediately when the video starts and we can also drag it further down here. So in iMovie there are two ways to create a fade effect and the first one is we can manually adjust the audio levels. Let's select the last couple of seconds of the audio clip like this and from here I would like to reduce the audio level. It's currently 100% and let's reduce it to let's say to 40% and for the last couple of seconds let's reduce it to let's say to 16%. Okay so when I play it one more time Now we hear that the audio level has dropped. And there is also a second way to fade out the music, which is a feature of iMovie. And all we need to do is to, after selecting the audio file, we need to drag the, this round fade handle somewhere to the left, like this, okay? And this will create also a fade out effect in a much easier way. Now when we play the clip again, we see that the sound is much smoother. And you can also do the same thing for fading effect as well. This time at the beginning of the clip, you just need to drag this fade handle to the, this time to the right side of the clip. Now when we play it again, now we have a nice fading effect. So video editing is one of the most time consuming things, especially if you are a content creator or a video editor. That's why I am using this AI tool while editing my videos, which reduces hours of work and effort significantly. You don't need any technical background, you just upload your raw footage and it does the rest of the editing for you within a couple of minutes. So if you want to learn more about this tool, then make sure to check out the next video. Also, please hit the like button if you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching and see you guys in the next one.